is Chinedu here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a membership site in ClickFunnels. Now, if you stay to the end of this video, I have a special bonus for you. Before we get started, why don't you smash the like button below and also subscribe to this channel. Also, bang that bell so you're notified each time I release a new video. Now, there is also a link in the description to a free 14-day trial of ClickFunnels, which you can use to practice how easy it is to build membership sites inside ClickFunnels. If you have a digital product like a course, then ClickFunnels is a place you can host the course so people can get access to your modules and your lessons. Also, you can use ClickFunnels to sell your course by building a sales funnel which is a big advantage and means you can save uh, some money, especially if you're on a budget and you're just starting out with a new course. A membership site is also useful for affiliate marketers to host their bonuses so that when someone buys through your link, you give them access to your bonuses in the membership area to avoid having to do it manually, which can be quite inefficient. So let's get into ClickFunnels itself. So this is the website and you log in through the member area at the top and that brings you to this page, which is your dashboard. You go up to ClickFunnels at the top and click on Build Funnel. So that brings up this page. And then this, this comes down, you click on the middle one, which sells sell your product. You click on choose, and that brings up membership. And you click on membership. You give your course a name. In this case, we're going to use Google Ads course, and you click build funnel. So that brings up two steps to create your membership site. So that's all you need to create a membership site, two steps. There's a membership access page and a membership area page. The access is where people log in to create their account after buying your course. And the membership area is where you're going to host your course. Now let's look at the membership access. So when you click on the membership access, you have to choose a template from here. So we're gonna select one of these templates. So that loads up and then you click on edit page. So that opens up, it's a simple page where people that buy your course will put in a password, put in their email, uh, they will create their, their password and also put in their email there. So this is a simple page which you can customize. You can put your logo and put some text in there. So when people buy your course, they'll come in here and create their account with a password. So it's a very simple page. You don't have to do much uh, apart from changing the text here. And now we go to the second page, which is the membership area. You click on that. Again, there are several templates here. We're just gonna pick the first one, select templates. Now, the membership area is where you're going to host your course. It's made up of sections under which you have lessons. So let's say you have a small course, you use one section, you give it a name, and then you're going to add lessons under that course. So the, this is where you add new lessons. So that's the first lesson there. 
which you can open. So you create a first lesson, you give it a name, and then you can put other, if you have videos or PDFs or whatever material you have, digit, any digital assets, you put them in here, you give them names and you download whatever it is. So very simple to create your lesson. So that's uh, one lesson and then you save at the top. And then you go back, add new lesson, you, you click on that. We can call that, so it's in the first part of the first section, you can call it lesson two. You create your lesson. You have to make sure it's part of the first section and then you, you click on create. So that adds your second lesson. And then you can open the lesson there and add all your digital assets, videos, document, whatever it is uh, yeah, for your course, you put them in there. So very easy. Then you can add a new section down there, give it a name and click on create section. So let's call it section two. As you can see, that's the second section. Now in click funnels, you give people access to sections. So once somebody gets into this section, they can see all the lessons in that section. They can lock the next section. So uh, if you have a, a course you're going to release over several weeks or months, you can give people access through these different sections. Because this way you can restrict access in there. When you click on that, you can put in your, your requirements. For example, they have to buy your course to get access to this section. So you give access to people in sections, but they, and they can see all the lessons in each section. If it's a small course, you can host it in just one section, for example. The other point to make, if you come up here, there are two URLs. There is a login URL which is what you give to people that buy your course to create their account and login. That's the login URL. There's a secret sign up URL, which is a URL you can give to somebody to get access to your course without creating an account. So you really, you really have to use this. And the login URL is what you use for members who have bought your course. That's what you give them. You shouldn't really give out your secret URL. So those are two important points to note. So it's very simple. You create sections, you put in your lessons, and you build your, uh, your course within ClickFunnels for hosting. Now, like I said earlier, you can also add a sales funnel by adding extra steps here and adding a sales funnel to this membership site. Or you can create a separate sales funnel to sell your course but it's easy to do both in one funnel and click funnels has that advantage especially if you are starting out with a new course so this is a very quick review if you have any questions please leave them in the comments below and i'll be quite happy to answer any of them now i mentioned some bonuses for you for staying to the end of this video now, I have three free membership site funnels for you, which you can download from this site, Bitly, my free membership funnels. So if you go to that site, you will get three free membership site funnel templates you can customize for your business. They will download into your ClickFunnels account. If you don't have one, when you download the funnels, you'll be prompted to create an account. And that's a free 14-day trial. And that's the link in the, in the comments in the description below for you to set up your ClickFunnels account. 
So if this video has been useful, uh, why don't you like it and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for watching this video and I hope to see you on the next one.